Guys, what's going on? It's your boy, the king of digital real estate, Nick Wood. Um, I just got done like maybe an hour and a half ago filming episode six of Making Hay with Dre. Quick plug for that show every Monday, 10 a.m. MST, right here on YouTube. We go live and we talk about all things digital real estate, AKA Dre. And today we talked about picking the right city. What are the tips and tricks to picking the right city? City, not city, city. What a day, what a lot of caffeine going on. Let me get a little more caffeine because apparently I need it. Mm. So as we talked about that, it made me think, and I, I had this thought, I'm like, I should do a quick little blurb about my favorite states for digital real estate. Rank and rent digital real estate, rent then rank. Rent first, rank later. Shout out to Drake, right? Anyway, so I'm gonna share with you guys my favorite states. And again, this is, this is spanning over six years. This is hundreds of websites. Um, I don't know how many deals, but millions of dollars of revenue that I have, that, that, that like I'm basing this off of. So this isn't I've done 10 or I've done five or I've done 50. I have done hundreds. I have made millions. And these, my friends, are my favorite states. And as soon as this video drops, everybody's gonna start doing all their homework because everybody knows my favorite niches and now you're gonna know my favorite states, okay? So let me go over my top three favorite states to do rank and rent digital real estate because y'all know my least favorite and the state that I say avoid like the plague. And I don't need to say that again here. I have another video that talks about it. So state number one of my top three favorite states is North Carolina, okay? I don't know if it was by accident. I don't know what, like, I don't even remember how I discovered North Carolina. All I knew like five years ago was that Michael Jordan was born in Wilmington and he went to school in Raleigh. That's it. That's all that I knew, I think. Yeah, that's Raleigh, North Carolina. That's it. That's all I knew about it. But as I started to do my homework and then I landed my first deal there, and then I've actually taken multiple trips to North Carolina because I had this little time of my life and my career where I was like, maybe I just need to fly to these areas and I need to go meet with people face to face. You guys have probably heard about that. Um, I've spent a fair amount of time in North Carolina. I really like North Carolina. Another reason I like it besides just the fact that I've been there and I've, I've done deals, one of the things I like about it is it's not just one of those states where it's like huge city, and then everything else is podunk, right? Like for example, Nevada. Nevada has Vegas, right? And it's got Reno. And then that's about it, right? Like there's Mesquite, but it's like not that big. So I guess there's Carson City as well. But the cool part about North Carolina is there's a lot of smaller cities, a ton of smaller cities, and they all fit the criteria. Well, not with every niche, but a lot of them fit the criteria of what I'm looking for. So my number one favorite state, North Carolina, bar none, okay? Number two, my second favorite state when it comes to rank and rent digital real estate, real estate is Tennessee. Tennessee, okay? Now, I've, been, I've also been to the state. I've been to Nashville, uh, not just, I think just twice. It was for brief periods of time, both times. But again, I like the people there. The business owners are cool. The business owners are hungry. The business owners are, are happy to talk to you. They're hungry. They're ready to go. Um, but on top of that, I just, I like the smaller cities. And if you look at, if you look at Nashville, I'm not trying to rank Nashville, but you look at all the potential cities around Nashville. You got Clarksville, you got Murfreesboro, you got um, Lebanon, you got um, Hendersonville. Um, i trying to think what else. There's so many cities that you could go into. And that's just around Nashville. Then we got Knoxville, right? And then we've got, um, I guess we got Memphis as well. We also have Chattanooga. It's just a cool state and there's a lot of smaller cities. And for my criteria, the criteria that I teach, I really like that. So Tennessee would be number two, okay? And number three of my top three favorite states to do rank and rent digital real estate is the good old state. Nope, you thought I was gonna say Utah. Not Utah, but Arizona, okay? Love Arizona. I actually have been there a couple times as well, like physically. Um, and it's, a, it's got a cool vibe. I like, I've been to Flagstaff. I've been to... Phoenix a handful of times. I've been to Scottsdale, which is part of Phoenix. Um, I like the state. I, again, same exact thing. I got, we got hungry business owners. 
within like just take phoenix for example yeah there's phoenix but there's these little pockets right that are part of phoenix we got glendale we've got um uh, scottsdale we've got mesa we've got uh queen creek which is kind of an uh, an outskirt we just have a bunch of cool little cities and a lot of hungry business owners but then we can go south and we can go to uh, tucson we can also look at fly so it's just a cool state Number three for me, and the reason I really got into this state is when I started getting into artificial grass, I noticed, hey, this state is really, really excited about artificial grass. I made a lot of money doing artificial grass in Arizona. And number three would for me would be Arizona. So again, to repeat those, it'd be number one, North Carolina, number two, Tennessee, and number three would be Arizona. Now, if you're like, hey, I'm gonna go do concrete, you're probably can you could probably guess that if you're gonna do some of the niches that I like. I've probably scoured it pretty hard. Now, I'm not saying there's not some opportunities because I didn't hit all of them. I never will be able to. But if you're going into a niche that I'm more recently talking about or that you have, maybe you have a niche that you found that fits the criterias like I've talked about, but it's kind of your thing. I would highly recommend you check out those states. Um, and again, Think about it like this. It's not just about those states. It's about why those states. And I told you guys, hungry business owners, really relaxed, cool, easy to talk to people. Um, and number three, the way that the city, uh, the state is broken up into these little subsections and these little pockets, that's what makes for a great state. So guys, again, as always, don't trust me. Just listen to what I'm doing, but also watch what I'm doing.